Hello, my second and third grade history friends. Soon to be third and fourth grade history friends. Do you know we have very few lessons left? It seems like we just started. It seems like I just am getting to know you now, and I feel so gypped that I'm not getting to be in class with you. I love asking you questions and having you give me the answers and seeing how much you've learned and how much you've grown. Are you practicing your physical timeline? Because after this week, the next video I'm going to send is going to be all of the additional timeline. And then I will also do one with all of the ones that we've done in the past. So we'll add them all together. I hope you're practicing. So this week we're talking about the second triumvirate. Do you remember the word tri? Tri makes you think of tricycle, triangle, meaning three. So we already learned about the first triumvirate and that fell apart. So now we're learning about the second triumvirate. And remember, the second triumvirate is a group of three men who were ruling over where? Over Rome. We've been learning tons about Rome these last few weeks. Um, <clears throat> so the second triumvirate is made up of three men. The first one is a man named Gaius Octavian. And he is the man who took over after Julius Caesar. Now, he was only 18 years old when he <clears throat> came into power. And he came into power because his adopted father, Julius Caesar, had been murdered. That's right, stabbed 23 times by the Senate. Um, and so he came into the picture to take over. And he sought out two men. He sought out a man named Mark Antony and a man named Marcus Lepidus. And the three of them were going to work together to rule Rome. So it would be a triumvirate. So this was a second triumvirate. And do you know what they wanted to do? They wanted to get revenge for Caesar's death. Do you remember who killed Caesar? Remember how Julius Caesar came into the Senate and he was attacked by 60 senators and stabbed 23 times. And of course, um, Gaius Octavian would take that personally because Julius Caesar was his adopted father. So <clears throat> the three of them tried to restore order to the Roman world as a second triumvirate. But did it really work? Normally, if something works, it lasts a long time. And the second triumvirate only lasted for 10 years. Do you know why? Because what we've learned over and over is when there is a group of men who love to have power and have to share it, what happens? Yes, they fight. They're always trying to get the upper hand. They're always trying to get more power. So Octavian and Mark Antony did not get along. Lepidus was driven out by the other two. <clears throat> or Lepidus was driven out and the other two fought it out. Um, and what happened? Instead of figuring out how to work together, they divided the land. So now you have Rome divided into two pieces and Mark Antony took the western land, no, the eastern lands, and Octavian took the western lands. And that's where we're gonna leave it this week. So Mark Antony is going east. And I want you to think, what letter does the word east start with? E. And in the eastern region was a famous city that we're going to learn a lot about next time. And that was Egypt. East, Egypt. All right? So we'll pick up with Egypt next in our next video. All right? I'll see you then.